working perfectly. Let's get my audio source a bit closer. And we're ready for the first let's play. The first live recording and playthrough of Wing Commander. Uh, so we're getting on further on in the later missions where I'm flying ships that I can't quite control and fighting ships that move in slow motion. Yes, it is the Wing Commander 1 problem. Let's right, continue. Let's just get started. Alright. Wake up. Wakey, wakey. I sure hope it's this one. Yes. I'll rip you. Alright, let's get. Yeah, I think we've already seen everything there is to see. Go to the mission briefing. What's our mission this time? Still in the Gimmel system? No. Hmm? Yeah. Okay. We're in the Gimmel system. Alright, boys and girls, listen up. We've just jumped into the Gimmel system. And we've got some work to do. Gimmel has been occupied by the Kilrathi for a short time. The Claw is not the first Terran ship to arrive. We've got a handful of battleships already in system. Most of these ships are currently under attack by Kilrathi. So we'll be dispatching fighters to help in their defense. The colonel quickly assigns the wings. Yours is the sixth assigned. Rip, you'll lead Zeta Wing to assist an Exeter class destroyer. Angel will fly in your wing. Here's the scenario. The Exeter is currently at Nav 1. Her skipper reports at least three Kilrathi fighters in the area. You'll head straight for the Exeter and help in her defense. When the Kilrathi have routed, come on back home. Any questions? Okay then, let's go burn those hairballs. Squadron, dismissed. You ready? Go! There you go. Let's get to your ships. I still forget the name of this ship. Is it the Scimitar? Okay, full speed ahead. Oh, that skipped over. Change to full guns and command Angel to break an attack. Okay, here we go. Stop flying in my line of sight, please. Thank you. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. So remember, control F12 to, uh, to speed it up. But, uh, yeah, might as well do it right now. One, two. See how much that does. Yeah, see, that's much better. Now, I'm afraid that after I kill this guy, he's gonna start going super fast. Alright, you're dead. There's one. There's two more of you fools. Alright, who, who wants some rip ram? Oh, I'm gonna ram y'all. Oh, I'm gonna ram on. You did. Alright, you got one more? I guess I do a little bit better when it speeds up, because when it goes too slow, man, it just. Uh, I don't know. I imagine it's gonna be like that the first time I load up Star Citizen on my laptop and it'll just start choking when the dogfighting module starts. People will be kicking my ass and be like, dude, you suck. Well, yeah, I suck, but. Not that bad. Alright, you ready? Where's the autopilot? Oh, there it is, right there on the left side of the radar. I didn't even notice where the autopilot light was. This is a kind of a funky design for a ship. Um, actually, stay on my wing for now. I'm gonna get closer to the ship, then tell her to break an attack. Okay. That will help get these buggers off that ship for a second. Oh, come on. 
I hate having to... It's an old game. I hate having to hold two buttons down in order to get a missile off. Oh, dang, we're kicking ass. Okay. Alright. Oh. Are my ejector systems hit? Yeah, okay, that's great. And my targeting system's been hit. Do you, um, did your ship self repair in Commander 1? I guess we can find out. Can we check our damage report? Ooh, wow. I've got a lot of damage. Well, I'm hoping that this was uh, the worst part because we already had two dog fights, and uh, oh, I better stay kind of far away from this thing. I'm gonna slow down a lot and uh, hit the autopilot because I don't think it does heal automatically in the Wing Commander, or at least Wing Commander One and Two. Um, am I ready to land? Slow down again because it's that sped me right back up. Tiger's Claw, may I land? I'm clear. Am I on the right side? Yes. Okay. That was a very straightforward mission. Very, very clean. Very, very clean. I got a lot of damage, but... Yes, it's hot out there in the cold vacuum of space. It is very hot out there with them kill Rathies. But, you know, they're burning in hell, so it's gonna be a bit harder for them. Or kill Rathie helped. I just got word from the skipper of the destroyer, Rip. Well done. Those Jalthi are the best the Korathi have. They were pretty tough, sir. But we got the job done. Actually, Mon Colonel, the Confederate Raptor has only a 34% chance against the Jalthi. All the more reason to be proud of yourselves, Captain Devereaux. Well, let's review the mission report. You took out six Korathi, Rip. Angel came up empty, because every wingman in this game is pretty useless. Well, maybe another target sometimes. For meritorious conduct in confronting the Kilrathi enemy, in the Gimel system on or about 2654-121, whatever the 121 means. The, Con the Terran Confederation is proud to present the Gold Star to Captain Ramon. What, what, did I skip the Silver Star? How do you get the Silver Star, man? Whatever, I'm not complaining. Is it made of gold? Your courage is exemplary in the co of the Confederation's finest defenders. Good job, Rip. Congratulations. A lot of awards. Thank you, sir. <laughs> it totally does look like freaking butthead, man. Yes. I fly fighter space jets. Uh, uh, yeah. Let's go talk to Shot Glass and get us some shot. And a Shot Glass. You heard about those new rapiers? Everyone's talking about them. I'm not so sure about them, though. I flew just about my whole career in scimitars and raptors. Like the raptor best, even though she didn't handle too good. She sure was fast once you got her going, though. Let's see who we got here. Is this Maniac and Hunter? Yeah, let's talk to Maniac. They say she... Oh, I missed skip the line. She says she's got tougher shields than anything in the fleet. She must be just about invulnerable. Hang about there, mate. She may have God's own shields, but she's armored like a white fr fighter. If they knock down the shields, she's no tougher than an on it. Wow, I never thought about that. <sighs> that's that's the real Keanu. They could get Keanu Reeves to do Maniac, I guess, in this game. Even though um, uh, he did uh, their casting for, of course, Wing Commander three and four was absolutely epic. Let's go on to Hunter. Skips another line. The claw is getting a prototype rapier to test fly. I've been looking over the specs on her. She's tagged a light fighter, but she's better armored than a scimitar. There's a pair of laser cannons for distance work, and a set of neutron guns for the dirty infighting. 
dirty and fighting like in this bar we're about to have here with old maniac. What's, what's my kill score? Oh, my number five now. Right behind Taggart. Is that Paladin? I believe so, yeah. And uh, I've already, huh? yeah, got more than Devereaux. Dang, man. So uh, you can do the math on that. Six and 32 is like what? Uh, <laughs> well, I'm butthead. I can't do the math, so let's skip through that part. All right, guys, that's the it. Uh, that's it for my Let's Play. Remember, uh, tell me if you like these videos. You know, this is, this is once again, I don't even announce myself, did I? Neff with the Bragas coming with another Let's Play. And uh, we're going to have a lot more on the horizon coming for you. So let's, uh, I'll see you next time. Peace.